Hi everyone. Today we're gonna to look at Dandelion. Dandelion name, Taraxicum of Chanel. Now, before that, I want you to remember to like and subscribe and comment down below. Right here, we have a few plants of dandelions. Now, on the, I'm gonna show you a photo of what we're looking at. Now, on the left of the screen is a plant that is not de photosynthesizing. But that's still edible. It's a little yellowish, so it's been buried a little bit from the leaves. On the right of the screen, we have plants that are forming photo, uh, uh, chlorophyll, so they taste slightly different, but both really good, same amount of nutrients. Now, where did this originate? Well, it originated uh, in Asia, and about 400 years ago, uh, the French brought it over uh, for uh, food and medicine. So right here, I recommend not deplenishing this food and medicine with all those chemicals of Roundup or 2,4-D. Easy to harvest. So first we're gonna harvest nice, lovely, young leaves. So let's try this. Tastes good. Now, easy to harvest, you can find the base of the root. And pull up. So, there's that. And I'll go back to you with a few more roots and show you after cleaning them and how to, well, uh, figure out what to eat. So stay tuned. Okay, we're back. Um, right here, on my nice bluestone cutting board, uh, is cleaned up of the dandelions. Now, what you want to do is like wash them off with cold water, not hot water, because this is we're, right now we're dealing with raw. You don't want to cook them under the uh, warm water. Uh, not yet. So. What you want to do is uh, just take a nice lovely knife and you can just cut it off, the crown, so, real simple and easy. That's like, uh, uh, that section right here is called the crown. And first off, here's a photo of the, what it looks like cleaned on the rock. Okay, so this section it's called the crown. So this can be eaten. A little crunchy, tender, earthy. Um, like I showed you, the leaves are edible too. And that's a with the crown. Like a uh, full-grown spinach flavor, like that earthy kind of spinach flavor. Yeah. Um, so if you look at the root of uh, the photo that I showed, kind of, or right here, actually better to show, um, towards the top, right here, is basically. Let's see. I mm, can't really see. Um, right here is a little bit up towards the top of the root. A little rough. This is an older root. So, you want to uh, cut that part off. It is edible, but it's not as good. So, the younger root, a few inches down from uh, what I showed of how long it is. Um, you want to cut that part off. And this is nice and tender, and I can just cut up in small pieces, put in stews, as they like that, or eat as is. Now, you can peel the outer part off, but that's where a lot of the medicine and that stuff is very good for your liver. It will, this dandelion is good for cleansing your liver in uh, early spring because the winter was hard.
a little crunchy. Now, it is kind of bitter, but after a while, if you eat this plenty enough, you get used to it. So I, I have gotten used to it in the past few years. Thought dandelion was extremely, extremely bitter. And uh, if you want the uh, bitterness gone from the root, I recommend uh, drying the root and then steeping it as like a tea formation format of a um, tea. Uh, and then just let that sit for 10 minutes or just boil it if you want it fresh. And that will get uh, most of the bitters gone on. And you can use the root in a stir fry. Um, what I've done. And real great. But the medicine is where the bitterness is. And you just need a little. You could go with that. Or have uh, a lot if you want to uh, use it as food. So boil it if you want to use a huge amount for food. Or if you're just going to eat a little. A little fresh like this. I recommend just eating on your little bench and rock cutting board. So, get outside, get fresh air, and have fun. See you next time.